Good afternoon, this is Jeremy Williams with Garden City Ammonia Program representing GCAPCoolCast.com, our online training division. Uh, today I'd like to bring you another R717 video tip of the day. And uh, today I want to talk about what we call in our books CUPL. Uh, that's the acronym for Corrosion Under Pipe Label. Uh, so today, adding some new labels to our new systems, I uh, decided to take an old one off and try to replace it with a new one. And what I found was some corrosion. So this is our discharge of our pumps coming this direction. There used to be a label right here called LTRL. As you can see, it's not bad at all. I'm going to get the wire brush out, brush it off, get to some fresh metal, and um, get a new base primer on that and let that cure, and then we'll put a new top coat on it. But just want to make you guys aware, if you've had some of our PSM classes or our ammonia refrigeration classes or even the books that go along with those, uh, CUPL is something talked about in them. Uh, it's something real. And, and as you can see on a horizontal pipe, it may appear underneath the label, not even knowing, on a horizontal pipe, such as more like this one, there would be more indication of maybe some rust running down the bottom of that. But uh, look at what your manufacturers say about pipe labels. You know, you don't want to be adhering the sticker to a steel pipe. The one I showed you was not adhered to the steel pipe by a sticker, just wrapped around it and uh, not caught. You know, you could go months, years, and have some significant pitting there, and it would be a complete replacement of the section of that pipe. But that's all I got for you guys today. Check out our online training at gcapcoolcast.com. Uh, if you're into getting some hands-on training, that would be found at gcaptraining.com. And uh, we got some rain today, and it feels good, 70 degrees, and I hope everybody has a great weekend. And until I get a chance to see you again, keep it in the pipes.